BYU football coach Bronco Mendenhall introduced the 2009 recruiting class. You probably formed your own impressions by now. Hopefully they're more accurate <laughs> than what you had formed um, over the past couple of months by what neighbors say, what the internet says, and what the number of stars our recruits have received. The recruits include five defensive backs, five offensive linemen, two linebackers, three tight end, three running back, and three wide receivers. The greatest solace that I take in this job is who's coming. Are they perfect? No. Have some already made mistakes? Yes. Will others continue to make mistakes? Absolutely. But are, is their intent correct? And do I believe they fit here? And will I put my name on them? Yes. So as you look at them, the great thing about visiting these kids in their homes, the houses are different in terms of size and shape, the states are different, the locations are different, but inside, um, similar goals, similar values, similar beliefs, and similar determination uh, to help our program. Most, when offered, not all, most when offered said it's always been my dream to come to BYU. Of the recruits officially committed to attend BYU include 18 high school seniors and three junior college transfers. Among those high school seniors, four of them are ranked nationally in their respective position, including tight end Richard Wilson, center Terry Aletto, safety Craig Bills, and linebacker Kyle Van Noy. Of the junior college transfers, they include Jordan Atkinson, Leah Aguirre, and Brian Logan. Two of the recruits will serve missions before enrolling and linebacker Kyle Van Noy will not enroll until next January due to a DUI. Coach Mendenhall says he will stay in the program. He committed to me and I committed to him quite a while ago, even though it wasn't made public uh, until recently. I believe he needs BYU. I'm not going anywhere. And the institution didn't ask me to delay his enrollment. Uh, I chose to do that. and so. I intend to bring him next January, and he'll have between now and then to make correct decisions in his life, reestablish who he wants to be, and I believe he's committed to do so.